Hi, in this video we are going to talk about flash fill. Suppose I have a data over here where I have a product code written over in this column. Now I want only the first three digit of this product code. So I can use the text function also which you will learn about later in this course. But there is a beautiful short method what you can use. Suppose you want only the first three digit. So what I will do is I will just type the first three digit of first product uh, or first code which will be XTR right then I will just select the second cell uh, just below it and press from my keyboard control E then you can see that Excel will automatically give me the first three digit of every code right so this is how you can use flash fill it has only one short key which is control plus E which will be very much helpful when you are going to uh, analyze your data or you are going to extract data from a certain text then you can use flash fill then if you want to extract last three digit from the code then what you can do is you can just type the last three digit of first code suppose in this case it will be 789 and if you press Control plus E, then you can see that Excel will automatically fetch the last three digit of every code. If you want the middle six digits, suppose I want the middle six digit of this code, then what I can do is I can just type middle six digit, which will be 240213 for the first code, and then I will hit Control plus E, and then I can see that all the digits, middle six digits will be entered automatically by Excel. Now let's look at another feature of flash fill. So right now we have seen how we can extract uh, data or information out of product codes or, or your raw data. Suppose if I want to extract uh, my information from something like if I want to extract name in two columns. So I here have full names of some people and I want to segregate them into two columns uh, for the first name and the last name. So how I can do that? For suppose the first person is uh, the full name is MRH. So what I can do is in the first name column for MRH, I will type Emma and then will press control plus E. Then I will get the first name of all the people uh, whose full name are present here, right? Then if I want last names too, then I will type rich which is the last name of first person and then I will press control plus E then I can see that I will get the last name of everyone which is present here. So this is how you can use flash fill also. So this is about extracting data this is about segregating data but you can also add up your data. Suppose you have first name and last name as two columns and you want to get the full name of the person so you can use flash fill for that also. So for the first person I will type the full name. So full name will, would be M, Emma and then Rich right and if I press control plus E then you can see that Excel will automatically give me the full name of everyone. Now this is about adding up name but you have a uh, you can use actually flash fill in a different manner also. Suppose you are an HR, you are an HR and you want to create the mail IDs of the new joinees and the name of each person is written in a format of first name and last name in two cells or two columns. Now if you want to create mail IDs, so what you need to do is you need to create mail ID for the first person. So let me create the mail ID for MRH and what would be my uh, uh, template? So I, the template would be first name, then I will add a dot between first name and last name, then at the rate my company name. So suppose you are working for a company which is named example, example.com. So what I will do is I will type the name of first person in this cell, Emma, then I will put a dot, then rich the last name, then at the rate example.com. So this is my format of mail ID and I have created the mail ID for the first person and as you can see I have written the letters all the alphabets in the small case not in the capital uh, capital letter right. So now if I press control plus E then you can see that Excel will automatically 
create all the IDs for every person with the same format. That would be first name, then add a dot, then last name at the rate example.com. Right? Eva.morgan at the rate example.com. And it has also recognized the pattern that I am creating mail IDs in lowercase only. So it has created all the mail IDs in lowercase. So this is how you can use. Suppose if you had to create all the mail IDs or if you had to write all the mail IDs manually, then it would have taken you a lot more time than this. But with flash fill, you can actually do it in an instant, right? So this is how you can use flash fill. I hope uh, you get it right and this will be a very helpful feature. So just remember the shortcut which will be control plus E. Thank you.